and we can go ahead and unveil the lotto machine. Ugandans are set for another shot at testing their gambling skills after the latest Rotary Farm and the National Rotary Lotto launched its services in the market. The new gambling game opportunity comes amid the strict rules and regulations from the government where values such as transparency, honest and protection of underage are supposed to be highly upheld. Any abuse of any of the rules and regulations would attract notification license of operation and prosecution. If in any event, unlikely event, that there, there, is, uh, there is no transparency, uh, there is no integrity of the whole system, I think government reserves the right to, to revoke the license and uh, get other players who, who can be able to, to play by the rules. A good number of youths in the country already love gambling, witness from games such as sports betting among others. Therefore, government is expected to make some good earnings from the activities if well managed. Through the operations and through the operations of uh, the National Lottery Sport, it will also be able to earn revenue for the, for the, for, for, for the country. Uh, so it is an investment, yes. That's a thing. This thing is bigger than great to see. Part of the returns from the game will be apportioned to charity activities to empower the needy. This is expected not only to improve revenues through taxes, but also improve lives and domestic incomes. For one to participate in the game should be an MTN subscriber with mobile man account to purchase Rotary tickets. And all prizes lower than 5 million Uganda shillings will be paid directly into mobile man account, but those above will be transferred into designated bank account or through a check. Nabakozeli Dia, NBS Television, Business.